With their angular faces, big ears, and smooth bodies, sphinxes are living and purring, proof that there's more to a cat than its fur coat. Here are a few facts about the fleshy feline. 1. They're from the land of ice and snow. You'd think a cat whose ancestors come from the North Country would be equipped with a warm coat. But the modern-day Canadian Sphinx, the hairless breed we know in North America, has been defying expectations since the mid-1960s, when an Ontario cat gave birth to a hairless kitten, the result of a natural genetic mutation. Then, in the mid-1970s, two separate sets of hairless kittens were born to owners in Toronto and Minnesota. Thanks to various breeding efforts, their lineages resulted in the affectionate animal we love today. Don't think, though, that the Canadian Sphinx is the only hairless cat out there. Similar breeds exist, and look-alike felines have been reported in countries across the world. For instance, the Sphinx has a hairless doppelganger, the Donskoy, that's actually a separate breed from Russia. While they look nearly identical, the Sphinx's lack of long hair is thanks to a recessive gene, whereas the Donskoy's hairlessness is the result of a dominant gene. 2. They're not actually bald. At first glance, the Sphinx might look less like a feline and more like a naked mole rat. If you pet one, however, you'll discover they're not actually hairless. Sphinxes are covered with a fine layer of downy fuzz. While they're not plush to the touch, their coats feel akin to suede. 3. They're patterned and colored. Although Sphinxes are naked cats, their skin pigment can vary in color and pattern. From tortoise shells to tabbies, you're bound to find a Sphinx version of many longer-haired cats. 4. They're not hypoallergenic. If you're a cat lover who's allergic to your favorite animal, don't shell out cash for a Sphinx kitten. Despite rumors to the contrary, the breed isn't actually hypoallergenic. Sphinxes still produce Fel D1, the allergenic protein in cat saliva and skin secretions that causes your eyes to grow itchy and red. 5. They're warmer than most other cats. The Sphinx cat naturally has a higher body temperature. This just goes to show you that genetics are pretty incredible. While the average feline has an internal temperature of 99.5 and 102.5 degrees Fahrenheit, to compensate for their lack of fur, the Sphinx cat's internal temperature regulates at 4 degrees higher. And even though these cats are a bit toastier, they still love to cuddle in blankets. Many do not even mind the occasional cat sweater. Above all, these are not kitties that should travel outdoors or roam freely. They can actually sunburn easily in the sunlight despite the external temperature. Obviously without fur to protect them, the elements are not their friend and this is intended to be an indoor-only breed. 6. They need a weekly bath. Think Sphinx kitties are super clean because they don't have fur. Think again. While your cat's coat might not be a magnet for dust particles, pollen, and other substances, its skin still produces oil. For most cats, oil help keeps their fur sleek. But with Sphinx cats, it can form a greasy film over their bodies, meaning their owners must give them weekly baths. The same goes for the ears, since there aren't any hairs to block dirt or dead skin cells from accumulating inside the cavities, owners have to regularly wipe them down with a washcloth or cotton ball to keep ears clear. 7. They have sensitive skin. Don't slather sunscreen on your Sphinx every time it sits in a sunbeam, but do keep in mind that because it's not covered in a dense coat, your cat's skin is more sensitive than other felines. And yes, they can get sunburned, they can get overheated or cold and, though they can go outside, they should be mostly indoor cats. 8. They're popular. While pet owners in America love furry cats like exotic shorthairs, Persians, and Maine Coons, Sphinxes are currently ranked the 8th most popular feline breed in the country, according to the Cat Fanciers Association registration statistics from 2014. 9. And friendly. While they share a name with the Great Sphinx of Giza, Sphinx cats are nothing like the Stoic statue. They're sociable loving, and playful animals, so much, in fact, that a recent study in the Journal of Veterinary Behavior ranks Sphinxes as the most affectionate cat breed. Why are Sphinx cats so friendly? Experts have a few theories, it could be because they rely on humans to keep warm, because friendlier cats might be selected for breeding, or because breeders tend to leave Sphinx kittens with their mothers for longer periods of time. 10. They eat a lot. Thanks to their fast metabolisms, Sphinx cats need more food than the average feline. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. 11. The Sphinx cats that played Mr. Bigglesworth in Austin Powers had punny names. The main Mr. Bigglesworth, Ted Nugent, was specially trained for the films, sitting still for up to 45 minutes at a time while actors screamed and actor Mike Myers petted him. 
It helped that he had been a show cat and was used to having lots of people around, animal trainer Tammy Maples told the Daily News. And also that he just loved Mike Myers. Mike always took time to talk to Ted. It wasn't just sit down, roll cameras. And when the filmmakers needed a Bigglesworth kitten for the spy who shagged me, they used Mel Gibskin. Later, as a grown cat, Mel served as Ted's double. 12. They still have patterns and colors. Depending on what the breed standards allow, these cats still have a lot of the unique patterns that regularly coated cats have. For example, the Sphinx can even have tortoise shell and tabby markings, just without the hair. 13. They're fun. Hairless cats have all of the fun attributes of every other cat, just with a few added perks. While the look isn't for everyone, those who get to know hairless cats learn that they are active, intelligent and affectionate companions that make a great addition to any home. 14. They are known to be fashion models. The Sphinx cat's unique appearance tugs at the heartstrings or causes a strange fascination among their admirers, and there is no shortage of fan pages across the internet. Those very images prompt an exciting question as Sphinx appear in every kind of outfit from the mundane to the outlandish. 15. Sphinx cats are very talkative. Sphinx cats meow a lot because they are one of the most vocal cat breeds. They meow every time they need something from you, may it be their basic needs or if they need attention. What is so intriguing is that they do not only purr and meow, but they like to talk back to their owners. 15. There are Sphinx cats with tattoos. Although this seems to have been happening for a few years, one of the first cases to go truly viral was in Russia earlier this year. The cat in question was tattooed by Alexander Pertov, a tattoo artist who worked in Ekaterinburg, Russia. It was his cat's fourth tattoo that made headlines, causing outrage from animal lovers and activists across the globe. The tattoos mimicked Russian gang tattoos and featured a prison tower and a man with a cigarette. In response to accusations of cruelty, Pertov reportedly replied. I hope it is not too bad for him, it is not his first tattoo. Usually, he feels fine and recovers from the anesthesia pretty fast. The tattoo trend continued. The latest case comes from Ukrainian bodybuilder, Elena Ivanikaya. Just days ago, it emerged that she had her sphinx cat, Yasha, tattooed with an Egyptian-style design. Critics were quick to condemn the act after she posted photos online, with many comparing it to torture. Ivanikaya, however, appears not to regret her decision and took to social media to defend her actions. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.